All right guys, so I am just leaving Higdon from Brits. We had a market this morning. It is, what is today? It is Tuesday the 9th right now, and it is about 2.50 p.m. right now. So on my way back from Higdon, I passed a couple of spots I fish. I was gonna fish off the place that's located uh, off the side of the freeway, mile marker 116. However, there's actually two cars parked there, so I just decided to go to this spot where I normally wade. But anyways, I have uh, the stuff I had up at Brits, so just a little bit of ultralight lures. I also have some worms with me. The water's moving pretty fast over here. But I'm gonna go ahead and give it a couple hours to see if I can get into anything. Okay, so I'm starting with the beetle spin, which is what I had Brit throwing last. This is the smallest one that I believe that they make. Yeah, so normally I can walk down all past this tree where I just cast under, but there may be some fish hiding underneath this tree. Yeah, so I actually bought Brit this rod. It's a Shakespeare micro series rod. I've actually had one of these before in the past and I really liked it but when I was casting I was under a bridge one time casting and I hit it on the bridge and I snapped it. But uh, yeah this just needs the, the line in here really sucks so I'm gonna change that out when I get home but other than that I really enjoy fishing on these. I actually went out yesterday but the water was moving fast as well and I don't have any didn't have any weights or any heavy, oop, or heavy lures to throw them in a tree. Oh no, I think I just wrapped myself up on accident. Okay, I got out. Yeah, but uh, I don't know about this beetle spin. Can't even cast right now. Got a darker beetle spin. Feel a little bit better, but this white, the red dot might not get it. Man, that's just how many times I'm gonna cast into a tree today. Fish on. Okay. Freaking ultralight, man. Nice bass. Come on, don't come off. Whew. All right. All right, that's what I'm talking about, man. Look at this nice bass on this little tiny Roadrunner, man. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for the day. I wish I could stay and fish longer, but I got a bunch of editing I gotta catch up on. But anyways, it was definitely worth coming out it just for that one bass. I hope you guys are all doing well, and I will catch you on the next one. Take care.